Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise, Praise the Lord. I'm glad to be here tonight. Amen. 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 Before we get started, shall we pray? Our Father, my God, we come thank you for this opportunity. Yes. Thank you for being God and God alone. Yes. Now, Lord, I'm asking you to sit me down and you stand up. Um, yes. Let, let your yes. words shine through and let your light shine through. Yes. Now, may the words of my mouth and meditation of my heart be pleasing and acceptable in your sight. Yes. Oh, Lord, you're my sugar, my redeemer. Oh, yes. Amen. 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 First, give an honor to God to uh, Bishop McKenzie in her absence of desire to know Mitchell, Reverend Dr. Madlock, family members and friends, God, to my Beautiful wife. All right. Patricia, going on 13 years. Amen. 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 Having not be here to share with you what the Lord has shared with me. And if you will, uh, get your Bibles or just look at the piece of paper in front of you. Amen. Uh, my assignment is the fourth one. Where number four. I'll be reading Mark chapter 15, verse 33 and 34. Amen. Those who have to say amen. 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 Don't say wait for me. Wait for me. Okay. Got me. Amen. The Lord brings sight to the blind. Amen. <laughs> amen. <laughs> all right. All right. It says, and when Jesus at the sixth hour has come, there was a dark, there was darkness. Mm -hmm. Over the whole land until the ninth hour. And at the ninth hour, yeah. Jesus cried with a loud voice, saying, Eli, Eli, mm -hmm. my master, mm -hmm. which is being interpreted, My God, mm -hmm. my God, why hast thou forsaken me? Mm -hmm. My God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? Mm -hmm. Now, the thought for this text is simply forsaken. Uh, mm -hmm. Forsaken. Mm -hmm. This is a word of pain. This is a word of anger. This is a word of um, abandonment. Uh, uh, abandonment. Uh, 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 uh. In our text, we see the height of it all. We, we see the height of his pain. He's experiencing the height of his suffering, the height of mental anguish, the height and weight of the world yeah. squirming on his shoulders. Yeah. And all of a sudden, uh, it gets dark. Uh, yeah, yeah. It gets dark. The Bible says darkness. Not just a physical darkness where it's one and two in the morning. Not just a six in the morning fog. It was more than a physical darkness. It was a spiritual darkness. Y'all not pray with me. Y'all not ready for church tonight. It was a spiritual darkness. Yeah, yeah, So dark you can feel it. Yeah. Have you ever experienced spiritual darkness? Yeah. Right? century, there is a spiritual darkness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So dark, you yeah. can feel it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In this city, there's darkness. Yeah. Yeah. So dark, you can feel it. Yes, in your neighborhood, there's uh -huh. a darkness. Yes, right. In your job, there's a darkness. Well, I'm a school well, teacher, well, and at the school, yeah. it's yeah. dark. Yeah, yeah. So dark, about you can feel it. Yeah. 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 Spiritual darkness, okay? Let's make it personal. Yeah, when you go to church, but you can't find the words to uh, pray. Uh, all right, all right. Yeah, you go to church, you see the preacher preaching, but you can't hear anything. Uh, yeah. 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 The choir is singing, but uh, you can't sing along. Well, yeah, I had to look at this text and turn it over a few times. I did my homework, I think. Uh, yeah. This was a different kind of darkness. This was not the darkness made by our hands of man. Uh, mm, yeah. Yeah. Uh, All right. This was not the darkness because there was a lot of crime in the street. Uh, uh, mm. This was a divine. Yeah. At, at, 
the noonday time, uh -huh. it was black. Uh -huh. yeah. This was fulfilling uh, Amos 8 and 9. It says, and it shall come to pass, uh -huh. saith the Lord. Uh -huh. yeah. I will cause the sun to go down at the end of noonday. Yeah. 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 In the midst of darkness, uh, Jesus was forsaken. Yeah. 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 This was the culmination of God's mercy and grace yeah. and his wrath all at the same time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. We have the substitute lamb. It's like the water being poured out yeah. on the Son of God. Yeah. All of yeah. sin, all of his yeah. wrath and anger yeah. poured out on the Son of Man at one time. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing between him and his wrath. Now, it is him and God's anger yeah. and his darkness. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, just like the little child. Right. 
to the Lord and the Lord heard me. Yeah. Oh, why have you forsaken me? Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh, uh -huh. All right. The three Hebrew boys, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, they was all in the fire furnace. Yeah, they, they, you might not only heard them, but you walked with them. Why have you forsaken me? Yeah. This was a stretch not only for Jesus. This was a stretch for God too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. His word said, I will never leave you, no for safety. Hallelujah. That's it. That's the He's word. He's break his own word. That's the word, yes. Yeah. Mm. He don't, he doesn't leave his servant, much less his only begotten son to be forsaken. But you find him separating himself from his own son. Remember, sin cannot stand in a very sight of God. You don't look the same anymore. So yeah. God had to turn. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes. His back away from his son. Amen. Amen. Oh, my goodness. But, but the, the person, my question still remains. Have you ever been forsaken? Mm. Have you ever been treated or betrayed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know uh, my enemies don't like me that much, but why did you do that to me? Yeah, yeah, I know yeah. my best friend did it to me. Why did you forsake me? Yeah, yeah. I know my cousins left me. Why did my cousins leave me? My husband forsake me. My wife forsake me. Yeah, yeah. Even my own children. And I know the Lord will stick with them, but this is different. The Lord is always with us, but he was not with this son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mama. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to steal, uh, go down and pray. 
God, we have to have this mentality. Jesus is keeping us alive. If God has forsaken us, we need to have the heart to not forsake him. Mm, mm, mm. Sometimes we may feel like the atmosphere is not right, but we still have to uh, see him. If you feel that God has left you, you need to stay with him. If you feel that the Lord has left you, you need to stick by his own word. Amen. Amen. 